In the Pendon period, the 1930s, railways provided a range of local services and facilities for people sending or receiving goods by rail. These were served by stopping freight trains that dropped off and collected vehicles. These were called pick-up goods trains and were a leisurely exercise serving all the stations on a particular line. A locomotive would collect a rake of wagons destined for stations or private sidings on the line and drop these off, collecting wagons for return as it did so. Speeds were low and sometimes the pick-up goods train would pause in the goods yard after shunting to leave the line clear for a passenger train to pass. The makeup of such a train was varied, with as few as one wagon or as many as 30. They often included a single goods van containing a small consignments that could be dropped off at a passenger platform without shunting the train into the goods yard. This train also contains two vehicles being returned to Swindon for repair. At the rear we have a damaged cattle van and in the middle a brake van labelled Watlington. On reaching the main line station or a marshalling yard at a junction where the main line, wagons would be sorted for collection by other trains and so a journey might involve several stages with the wagons being resorted several times in marshalling yards. Once they arrived at their final mainline station or junction, the journey might be concluded by a final pickup goods train delivering along a branch line. Great Western number 2323 is one of William Dean's celebrated 2301 class of 060 goods engines, first introduced in 1883. There were 260 of these locomotives in all, and some were still running into British Railways era, mainly in Wales. Their light axle loading made them valuable for use on lightly laid lines that could not take heavier engines. And because of this, a number have the unusual distinction of having been shipped overseas twice, each time in support of military logistics during the two wars of the 20th century. We hope you have enjoyed this short video. We have a lot more from Pendon to share with you. Click on the link below to access some of our hidden gems and do subscribe to our YouTube channel, which we update regularly.